best playfield gameplay and layout. Hi everyone, this is Antoinette coming to you from Orlando, Florida, and here are your nominees for best playfield gameplay and layout. Elvira's House of Horrors by Stern Pinball. Lead designer, Dennis Nordman. Jurassic Park by Stern Pinball. Lead designer, Keith Elwin. Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory by Jersey Jack Pinball. Lead designer, Pat Lawler. And the winner is... Jurassic Park by Stern Pinball. Lead designer, Keith Elwin. Much like Iron Maiden before it, when I would go into Keith Elwin's office and play his first Whitewood of Jurassic Park, I was smiling the entire time I play it. And this is a, in a state where it's got no artwork, no rules, no sound. We're just flipping balls around the, the physical design. I would walk out of his office smiling and I would come back the next day looking forward to shooting it again. Um, Keith and the entire rest of the Jurassic Park team just really did a fantastic job with that design, with the toys and all the different elements on the play field. That spinner on the premium for the helicopter blades, which I like to call the L-spin, um, that was just such a unique and brilliant design and it was something so simple. The Raptor pen was another thing I thought was just a great use of that space and it really feels like you're capturing a ball in a cage. And of course the dinosaur mechanism is probably, probably the best mechanism we may have ever done at Stern. We've done some good ones over the years. Um, on behalf of the entire Jurassic Park team, thank you so much for your support. Thank you for your votes. On behalf of Stern Pinball, thank you also for your continued support and patronage, for playing our games, for your passion that we certainly share with you, and we look forward to bringing more great games to you in the future. Congratulations, Jurassic Park team, yet again. Carrie, how many awards did they win this year? My goodness. Well, we're on our last...